I see a railroad spike. No new bottles yet. It's another railroad spike. Right where the palm tree is. A and W. Can lid. What in the world are you? Oh, I thought it was a safe. That's just like a concrete block. Broken bottle. Cinder block. Brick. That's modern. There is a whole bunch of bricks in here. Broken bits of bottles. I'm sure this gets picked over quite regularly. Oh, there you go. Over here is where there's a bunch of fish in there. Oh, there's tadpoles. That's cool. Cool little spot. Huh. The glare is a little intense on the water. There's something around and there's a beer bottle. Big old barrel. 55 gallon drum lid. Huh. Yeah, not super old. Well, let somebody else find it, I guess. Whoops, there she goes. Just a whole bunch of bricks and stuff in here. There's a bottle there. No, maybe not. It's like a stove part there. Okay, let me uh, set you up here. Hopefully I don't fall in. Yeah. Not quite. There we go. Ah. 
Did I get it? Yeah, I got it somewhere. I need my polarized glasses now. I can feel it. Maybe. I think that bottle is like straight down here, but I don't want to fall in. Ooh. Is that an old one? It's on the bottom. You tell me if that's an oldie. Yeah, oh, we got it, folks. Yeah, on it. it looks like a blob top. Yeah. I wonder what that one is. Yeah. Huh. Hard to tell what's on here. Yeah, I want to grab that freaking SOB. That one over there? Yeah. You want to walk over and get it? Yeah, it might. Maybe. I don't know, though. I don't want to get my... I don't want to get my shoes wet right before... Airfoot. Oh, yeah, with all the glass. I think this is an old one, folks. That is quite old looking. It's like a blob top. Maybe, I don't know. It's an old one, I just don't know how old. That's a really, really old bottle. The other one over there, I guarantee, is old too. Well, we know how that goes. Oh yeah, we might be able to reach it like that. Yeah. That's like a blob top, kinda. That's a beauty though, that's like an old beer bottle from the turn of the century. I might be able to guide you. <laughs> no! Oh, don't fall. <laughs> Straight down. Um, over this way, yeah, no. Basically straight through those little things. There it is. Oh. Now it's going to be super cloudy. There it is. Don't fall, please. Yeah, I can swim. Now I can probably get it. I can swim. It? Yeah. Right there. Oh. Shit. Um, where's the hole of it? I might uh, yeah, chuck it. Yeah. 
Do 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 do. I believe that is a Heinz jar. Heinz or Curtis brothers. Huh. Doesn't say anything on it, so it might be uh, a different brand. Yeah, it's machine made. Huh. Yeah, leave that for future guys. But that one's not machine made. Yeah. This one is. This is probably about 20s or so. Might turn purple. It might. It's probably whoa, about that time period. Out back and see the turn. Why not? Let me try to get the junk out of it. Ugh. I guarantee you there's a bunch more bottles in here. That's crazy. Two nice old bottles right here in the creek. The one I got here last time I pulled out of the bank over down that way. Yeah. Down there was just sticking out. Yeah, I see some bubbles. Not as many bubbles as that one though. No. She's a beaut. That's the honey hole spot right there. Oh, we got a spark plug. An old spark plug. P44. AC. That's cool. I'll hang on to that. I like spark plugs. Beautiful stoneware. I bet you there's some Hutchins and bottles and stuff in here. Oh, what are you? It's a bone! We got a human bone. Not really. It's an animal bone. Somebody's food. Supper. A big old bolt. Big old bolt. You got a spark plug? I'll zoom in on it, show some people. One old guy said there was a spark plug. Up there. He used to work on Model T's and stuff. Oh, yeah. Back in that corner up there. I remember you telling me about that. So there was an old Model T workshop right up the hill here. Maybe they just chucked the old spark plugs out back. That green AC, I think that's pretty old. I don't know, spark plugs are, uh, we found some really old ones before. I don't got horseshoe on it. That's green. not as that's old. Guy, yeah. That's uh, not crazy old, but the green ones I think might be from the 80s if I remember correctly. It's puking. Root beer. That is some stinky, stinky stuff. Oh, see that gold looking color? Here, I'm gonna pass that up to you. Oh, and there's a bottle. What in the world is that? I don't know. Yeah, that one's not that old. You know what that is? Yeah, it's off a cable line. 
cable. Okay. Not that old though. That's probably 50s, 60s. There's a jar right here. Like I said, probably about 40s, 50s. Gold coin in it? I don't think so. <laughs> Not even gonna check this time. <laughs> It's a very modern bottle there. Bricks are just falling out of here. This thing is just probably filled with bottles. Oh yeah. On the old train station. That's cool. Oh, there's an old flywheel? <laughs> Flex plate, whatever you call that. Is that? No. Kind of thick for a flywheel. It's a gear. It's not heavy enough to be a flywheel. Or flex plate, whatever you call it. Crawdad. I have never seen a crawdad down here. No. I found a stubby. I got me a stubby. I knew it was something cool. Look at that little stubby screwdriver. That thing's still good. It's plastic, so it's not ancient or anything, but that's a good screwdriver. It's not wallered out or anything. There's a little bit of chrome left on it. Oh yeah, if, anybody, if anyone's wondering, that is not from uh, metal detecting. That's from fixing my uh, AC unit. I did not, it's not from gloves. Oh, purple glass. Purple bottle top. It's purple. That means it's uh, made with that material to make it uh, turn purple when it's sitting outside. Bob knows more about that than I do. And there's carnival glass. Purple bottle top, cork top. It's cool just looking in the creek. Definitely purple. Yeah. That's cool. Manganese in it. Manganese, that's it. What? Nah. Save it for a future guy. And I got my stubby. <laughs> Oh, huh. I'm gonna walk down here and look. It's interesting. Hopefully y'all got to see the crawdad on film. Or technically we don't have film anymore, but you know what I mean. Oh. Oh no. Milk bottle. Half pint liquid sealed milk bottle top. That's the one with the cream top bulb too. Dang. Whoa. Oh man. It's not ancient but I've never found a complete one. I have found one that was cracked but sealed half pint liquid.
That's cool. An old milk bottle. Never found one of them before. And I guess technically I still haven't because it's broke. That's a big old spark plug. That one's out of like a tractor. And we got a spark plug. I don't remember. Mason jar lid. I think down here we saw a bottle and we it was really deep and we didn't want to fall in. Yeah, we tried. I think it was right in here. There is a ton of crayfish holes everywhere. Just bring a trap and drop it in. Yeah. Well, I'm not seeing that bottle now. Must be a plastic one. Oh, there's a. Uh, Railroad spike. That might have been what we saw. I can't remember. It's a bag of something. Probably a decomposing hand. We're in Tweaker City right now, so we, you never know. Part of a glove, a bone. This is cool. Aluminum. Just no knowing what you can find around these little creeks in the cities. And we're right on the railroad too, like I said. You got Slim Jim wrappers mixed with old spark plugs and 1800 bottles. You just never freaking know. Oh crap. I'm not doing that jump with all this stuff like Bob just did. Oh, there's a license. Somebody's looking here. License. A lot of free fish in here. I might have to block that out, but somebody's license. When does it expire? Oh, they replaced it already. Well, that sucks. I'll put it in the bag just because somebody probably stole something. I don't really want to be showing you people's IDs. Oh, there is a uh, something. Some strange rubber things that are in the shape of a circle. I wonder what those could be. Bow chicka wow wow. You don't want to touch the strange rubber things. We try to keep this uh, family friendly when we can. I don't 
don't want to force that talk on your children. Wrap up time, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go over all the stuff we got out of the creek here. Good little day. We spent about six hours detecting and about a half hour looking through the creek and we did the best going through the creek. We found that lady's ID, which uh, kind of sucks. It's not the newer ones. Um, this is one of the older licenses. But uh, yeah, it's not the new one, so it hasn't been issued within the past couple of years. They probably lost it a couple of years ago. Who knows? This one's from the 20s. I guess I can send that back to the DMV. They might be able to return it to them, but if they lost their ID, I'm sure they got a new ID by now. That guy. That's probably an olive jar, pickle jar, something along the lines. We got a stubby, a little stubby screwdriver. That's so good. Could put him to work. In a little, get inside the little itty bitty places where you can't get a big old uh, screwdriver. We got a big old uh, spark plug. I think that one's gapped a little too much. <laughs> Been rolling around the creek. If it wasn't gapped to nothing, I'd bet. Yeah, the thing would probably never work again. It's actually still got a gap in it. But it's brass. That's weird. It's got a brass nut. Not, uh, well, no. That looks brass. I guess that's algae. It's actually iron. Don't know the brand on that one. This one's a green old LCAC. I guess AC Delco. Uh, R44T Acneter Acneter Green. I'll look that up. ACR44T's Acneter. I think it's probably 70s or 80s. The green one. I think I remember seeing the green ones are from that era. And the Pista de Resistance. Big old beer bottle. Hand blown. I don't believe it's machine made. It might be machine made, but I don't know. It's very, very wavy and like circle patterns and it's got scratches all the way down it. There is a line that ends right there. And I think it might be a blob top. It's hard to tell. It's been in the creek for a while. It's got that beautiful Victorian style on the bottom. The embossing, and it would have had a paper label, which is now gone. But she's a beaut. Thick, thick, thick bubbles on that thing. It's hard to show you, because it's like real dark amber. But she's a beautiful, beautiful beer bottle. And this guy, I don't know if I showed you this. Big old crooked whiskey bottle. He's hanging a little bit to the right. Got some uh, loads of bubbles. This thing's even older. This thing has got so many bubbles in it. And there's a really long, big one. I mean, they're everywhere in this thing. Tons and tons and tons of bubbles. There's a really big one. Really big, long bubble right there. Big old whiskey bottle. The haul for the day.